There's a lot of people going in and out of pools today, but is the pool actually safe? Those chemicals play an important part, and the testing of them is even more important. What's better on a hot day like today? In the pool. But with all those people jumping in, everything from sunscreen to sweat is jumping in too. The chemicals in the pool are supposed to keep them clean, but if they're not balanced correctly, the pool could put you at risk. We headed out with the aquatics team at Indy Parks. They showed us the process of what it takes to test a pool. Uh, first, you want to go deep enough so that you're not getting a, a surface reading. What we're looking for to happen is a color change. And here we have our guidelines on what it could be. Hold it up to some natural lighting. All right, and we know that ours is sitting at about a 7-4, which is where we want it. Indy Parks follows a strict schedule of testing pools every hour on the hour. They test for chlorine and pH, making sure they're balanced to standards set by the CDC. But what about that neighborhood pool or the one at your apartment complex? While they're supposed to be kept to the same standards, many are unstaffed and don't get the every hour check like the pools at Indy Parks do. Health experts say you should be wary of those pools, especially on busy days. As an aquatic professional, I test water before I get in it anywhere. Um, I think that it's, it's, it's probably a best practice, and that's what I do when I go someplace. I'm going to test the water before I get in. So what can you do before jumping in the pool? First is ask questions to the pool staff. Ask them how often the chemicals are actually tested. And the answer should be every hour. You can also buy one of these test strip kits on Amazon. They're about $10 for 50 tests. What you can do is take that into the pool dump it into the water, it'll change colors and you can reference the key on the side of it to see exactly what the chemical should be and if they're safe. Reporting tonight, I'm Call 6 Investigates, Paris Lubell.